It's like the Spirit answered all of my prayers. And now I resent him for it. I used to take so much time for myself to just sit and be silent. I haven't heard that sound in years, but I replaced it with a lot of voices that claim to be God. The first poem that I ever wrote was about San Francisco and the homeless and what I was told. I was 12 years old and I rhymed poor white bro with chips from Nabisco, give it to a beggar as he pushed his cart down the road. That boy got buried beneath hate and Ashbury, beneath the Ben and Jerry's, and a big city and a pretty girl. Man. That is the only thing that he needs to get his heart to beating again. But this all used to be for nothing and no one, and now I shout transparency, but I miss every single one of my sins. I would rather know pain than be numb. But then again, we ask for the opiates to numb the pain for us. But I always fall asleep to dream of mending up my wounds. Then wait to spend the day reliving every bruise for the sake of a sad song. Or a sweet repose. Or seeing the blood flow from the stitching like it were a cavalry of demons in retreat. Promising to leave me alone. They are alive. The liars, the release has never been satisfying. There's the promise to fix what's been sown. We get bottled up like the alcohol gets bottled up and then we bottle it up in us. And I search for ways to define myself by some skeptical lack of trust because if I can't trust in anything, I'm not to blame for my lack of movement. Mm. I can abuse all of you. And all of your pity, and I can convolute it. Like my sister used to sing when she was younger, but the world ain't got in her throat. And she put that dream away while coming of age acted as a serpent and questioned her home. When I was younger, I wanted to be a cowboy. <laughs> and then I wanted to be Superman because that is the natural progression of things. <laughs> and then, then I wanted to wear my fake green snakeskin plastic Walmart parent bot cowboy boots, you know? You know. With the red uh, inside out underwear, it was white on the outside, but it's red on the inside for some reason, so I turned them inside out and wear them over my blue sweatpants with my blue long sleeve shirt and the red bath towel cape with the little rope and the clothespins and the yellow diamond cut felt Superman S iron on mom costume and be cowman. <laughs> like I am a cow. Like all of my fantasies about my wife to be were based upon things that I should have never seen. Like all of our fantasies about our wives to be, based on positions that should have never been idolized by my eyes. Worshipped as though they gave me life, but that's the nature of the beast. And he still squirms next to wisdom as she screams, mm. clawing for me on the streets. And how does life begin as a seed that turns out to scream for something? Come on, come on. Like someone misnamed gift for to be inherently found and wanting. And if there's so much joy to be found, then tell me where I went wrong. Mm. For all of the times that I have tried to satisfy my mom, I still cannot write one joy-filled song. Mm. And I tried. I tried, and come October, I thought that I could do it. But November threw us into a whirlwind again, and come January, I knew it. All of the things that I told anyone that would listen about the hopes that I had found are lying in a hotel bathroom mm. in a puddle of my dad's blood on the ground. And someone will love that because it's honest. And somebody will hate it because it's crude. And as for me, anytime I stand and give my testimony to a crowd, I will lie awake at night and wonder about whether or not I told the truth. God forgive me. 
I believe so many lies that come from the mouths of so many good liars, namely me. That's good, that's good. But I'd rather tie a millstone around my neck and throw myself into the sea than perpetuate some emotionally driven blasphemy that you don't care for the suffering, suffering and servant. Give your children eyes to see the wonders that you have for them and ears to hear the direction for their wandering, wandering feet. Grieve with me. Mm. Do you grieve with me? Look at the cross, the promise we receive. I will grieve with you with groanings too deep for words. Mm. I will sympathize with the temptation to believe the lies that you have heard. I will mourn over the loss of finite family and friends. And I will defeat death so that you will know that death is not the end. Come on. At the cross of Christ, I know that the bonds of sin are broken. That they bar the gates of hell for me, and that heaven's doors are open as wide as my sweet Savior's arms were stretched out when he died. And love has defeated death with a light for me to hope in. At the cross of Christ, I know that despair has been removed. That it drowns beneath the crushing weight of hopeless found in you, as blood spills and puddles to cover every self Murder becomes salvation. The resurrected truth at the cross of Christ. I know that anger has found its vengeance. Mm. That righteousness became sin for me. And that only at the remembrance of a man acquainted with sorrow do I stand forgiven of my resentment as wrath and justice turn aside to crucify my defendant at the mm. cross of Christ. I know that shame has lost its place. That Jesus Christ endured the curse and scorned all of the disgrace and atoned before the throne as death fled without a trace that I might enter in and look full on his wonderful good patient kind sovereign suffering joy filled face at the cross of christ i know